know you want to holiday shop, right? Well, tonight we launch a very special user's guide to holiday shopping. From snagging the best deals to downloading the best holiday apps all week long, we're dedicating this segment to consumers, to shoppers, to you and me. And later this week, we'll even take an inside look into the iconic toy store FAO Schwartz with a preview of the most popular toys this season and a nostalgic look back at childhood favorites. You won't want to miss that. That's going to be a ton of fun. But first, not all those Black Friday deals are deals at all. Joining me now with advice for your wallet, Candice Cerro, a consumer savings expert for promotionalcodes.com. Thanks for coming on the show, Candice. I want to drill down, because we haven't done this and you don't see it very often, about retailers. What are the best retailers to check out? out this year. You know, one that's always actually great on Black Friday is Apple, surprisingly. This is the one time of year that we've traditionally seen them offer deals on electronics. So if you're looking for that laptop, that iPad, really check Apple out at this time of year. Now, Macy's is going to be open too, right? Right. Macy's, Walmart, a lot of retailers are going to be opening on Thanksgiving. So I think that that means we can expect the deals to also match that. They'll also be close online as well. Walmart will be competitive no matter what. They, they always, always are. are. Yes. Now, let's take a look at the at the stores that are going to be open on Thanksgiving. We gave you a partial list. Let's do the whole list. Kmart, Old Navy, Toys R Us, Best Buy, Kohl's, Macy's, Target. The list goes on and on. Even Office Max and, of course, Sears. Let's w walk us through some of the products that people should be buying on Black Friday because not everything's a deal. What is a good right. deal that day? If you're looking for electronics but you don't care about the brand, that's definitely something that's wonderful to buy. As you mentioned, all those stores that are opening, we're going to see a lot of great deals on apparel, but those are also going to be matched online. So that doesn't necessarily mean that you have to go into stores. Houseware is always a great thing to buy, just in November in general. You know, I understand the pots and pans. If you want right. those high-end pots and pans, they never go on. They they never go on sale now, but they will be on sale on Black Friday, so keep your eyes open for that. Now, you mentioned apparel, but not winter coats, right? The, the heavy-duty winter stuff, right. they're still trying to get top dollar That's for That's one of those things you have to wait for the season to change, so January is the time to buy that kind of apparel. Let's talk about the deals to avoid, because let me tell you, I think people walk into the store assuming that every sale is a good sale. You say that's not true. Yeah, that's definitely not true. Some things you want to wait until Cyber Monday to buy. We're seeing at promotionalcodes.com that anything like a vacation package, anything that's only a .com and not a brick and mortar, you want to wait until Black, or until Cyber Monday for those. And then also on Black Friday, you really just want to check out you know, all of the electronics, but not the name brand electronics. You know, the Samsung. most surprising thing I've found is don't buy toys now. Don't Which buy would, toys. It's probably big on people's lists. Why not? Right. Waiting for the two weeks leading up to Christmas. They're going to be on sale, but the sales are going to get even greater as you get closer to the holiday. So you advise procrastinating, but moms tell me they're afraid that the retailer is going to run out of what they want to buy. What do you say to them? If you're really worried about it, then they're still going to be on sale now, so you'll still be saving money. But if you're really going for the deepest deal, you have to wait until the two weeks before Christmas. And you say winter apparel. Forget the holiday season. You've got to right. go in January. Right. That's when the seasons are changing. It's going to hit the clearance rack it's going to be almost 60 percent off so that's when you want to buy those deals and that's the same for the name brand televisions when the 2014 models roll out that's when the 2013 models will be on sale so if that's what you're looking for wait until late december early january you know it's tricky you have to be very careful about what you buy right yeah, you have to be a savvy consumer and do your research well you just helped us do that candace thanks for coming on it's great thank to you see for you having again. me